everybody. Good morning. It's about 11 o'clock ish, I think. Um, yeah, it's like 11 o'clock or something. Um, I just kind of decided how my day is gonna go for Tanya's challenge. I think I decided like at least every hour I'm gonna try to do a like item description thing. Um, so I just woke up, so now I'm gonna do one. And I think, um, uh, this. I'll do this now. This is a flash white, obviously. And yeah, flash white. I keep this next to my bed because the er, the power doesn't really ever go out in St. Cloud. And I mean, Stark Rapids, like very often. But I'm always paranoid that if it does go out, I'm not gonna be able to see anything, you know, obviously at night and um I don't like that idea and plus you know I want to be able to find my way around the house so I keep the flashlight next to my bed in case the power goes out so I'm not going to be stumbling around looking for one. I need to go do the dishes and vacuum. There's one chair in our house that's like covered in white dog hair now because my dog leans against it and then his hair is just all over it. Maybe I'll go film that just so you guys can see how bad that is. Okay, this has definitely been deemed video blog worthy for the day. I purposely went and found my dog for you, so. Here's Max. No. Pretty dog, right? You know, he's a lab and he doesn't have a lot of white hair, you would think. But uh, if we go and look at this chair upstairs, he has a lot of white hair, we found out. Here's this infernal chair that I now have to vacuum because there's that much hair on it. The chair is supposed to be this color, red, but now it's this color because there's dog hair everywhere. Okay, it's about an hour later and so for the rest of the day for my description, I'm gonna um, put a number on the screen to let you know how many descriptions I've already done for anybody who's counting at home. And then I'm going to um, keep my descriptions really short and simple so that my video is not like 15 minutes long because I'm sure that would get kind of boring. So for my next description, um, I have a pair of, now I gotta get it out. I have a, a pair of tickets here and they're for the Green Day concert that's at the Target Center this weekend because I'm going to Green Day, yay! Next, I have a boot. Pretty self-explanatory, right? I wear it with my back clothes. Another one, uh, this is my lens cap, which I'm not going to lose again. This is Stephanie, who's full of awesome, and she's the president and creator of a bunch of different clothes. And then she has something to describe. I have a stick! I got thrown at it by pockets. <laughs> <Don't get thrown laughs> at it. I'm that strong. So my next item with the kitty. Could write a man in the apartment and she has a cute kitty. Cute kitty. There you go. That's another item description. This is my puppy. His name is Max. And he's 11 years old. So I've had him for a really long time. I, um... I've had him since I was eight years old, there you go. And um, he's my awesome puppy, so cute. Baby puppy, my baby puppy, he's wearing his tail. Yeah, my baby. Quick fire descriptions. Um, this is a remote, it's for my TV. And this is another remote, it's for my PS2. These are mints that I got for donating to Hot Topic. And my sister and I call them LSD because they're like little white mints and they taste disgusting. It's an iPod, right there. I won it in a contest and obviously it's for listening to my music. These are batteries because my camera runs on four AA batteries and it doesn't usually run out really fast. Um, the battery power lasts a while, but uh, I need backup batteries. This is a wallet. I had to buy a new one because my old wallet fell apart. Uh, and this one mainly just holds my driver's license and a bunch of random cards and that's the phone ringing. Hold on a minute. 
Okay, so to describe my day, basically I woke up and ate some oatmeal and Pockets called me because Stephanie was in town and so she wanted to hang out with me. So I hung out with Stephanie and Pockets and Lindsay and Amanda and Rio showed up eventually and so I hung out with all of them and we did some extreme tumbling filming and uh, Pockets will probably have that video up eventually so I'll make sure I let you guys know when she gets that up and then basically just hung out with everybody we came back to my house because my memory card filled up really quickly and um, then went to Amanda's apartment and hung out again and I decided to come home so I could get this all finished because it's going to take me a while to go through the footage from today and figure out what I want to use and what I don't and um, my feet are really dirty <laughs> So I'm going to go clean my feet and um, start getting this video figured out. So I will talk to you guys all later. Bye. Okay, for we tomorrow, to I realize... Oh, hi. Oh, sorry. <laughs> you need to keep that like that. <laughs> I was just going to say, um, for tomorrow, I realized that Tanya has gone a bunch of times, but we haven't seen Ashley at all. So Ashley, you get to go tomorrow and Pocket set a challenge for you. Alrighty, this challenge is thought up by me with a little help from Lindsay. The challenge is specifically made for you. Your challenge is you need to reenact your favorite scene from either Togi Nanochi, Lamento, or Sweet Pool. You, you, if you feel the need to, you can do one from each game, but only one is needed. But three would be way cool. You can do three. That'll be your extra credit challenge. Yeah. That's it. You get bonus love from me then if you do that. Shut <laughs> up! Yeah, you want that bonus love, don't ya?